Hello my loves! I'm here today to do a what's in my bag video because I try to do these fairly often. Frankly, you guys demand it, so let's get right into it. This one is from Target again, and I wanted to show it sooner because last time I showed a Target purse, y'all were frustrated you couldn't find it, so I'll give you the details on this, but it's a pretty big bag. I love me a big bag, but it comes with this really long crossbody strap. It can be crossbody or shoulder. I'm a shoulder bag girl, so I just keep it at a length that works for me to wear it over my shoulder, but I was just impressed at how long this strap is that a tall girl could wear it crossbody. But I think this bag is just a little too big to be comfortable crossbody, but it is really cute, very, very functional. Um, sometimes I prefer like a lower end bag like Target that I can really like throw around when I'm running daily errands. So that's the situation with my current bag. So I already showed you this in my last video. I think everybody was correcting me that this is a hedgehog, not a porcupine. But it's a really cute little charm from Bath & Body Works. Pink fuzz ball. And he has a hand sanitizer inside. <laughs> so I love a functional purse charm and I love to have hand sanitizer on me at all times. So that's the outside. It has almost a warm gold, almost like a rose gold hardware on the bag. Not quite rose, but warm. And just really pretty. So I'm not sure what this flap is for. It kind of covers the zipper, but it kind of doesn't. And it also has a, like a shorter shoulder strap or a hand strap. I love when there's options of straps on a bag. <laughs> All right, so let's start outside. There's this zipper pocket in the back. Can you see the purse if I put it there? And this is where I keep my phone, so it's just the most accessible. Six plus, so it's a really big phone, so that tells you it's a really big pocket back here. And um, just quickly, I'll tell you it's a Goyard inspired case from Etsy and this is from the 99 cent section at Staples and I also have this lip pouch this is from Sephora and I usually use it to keep extra lip products in these aren't even my go-to lip products but I have the Je Ne Sais Quoi lipstick by It Cosmetics it's one of those that kind of warms up to your skin tone and turns a different shade of pink on everybody and that came with this lip serum which is really like a lip gloss and I have this lip gloss, again from Bath & Body Works, and this is the mentholated one I was telling you all about. So that pouch is mainly just for lip products, but sometimes I'll stick like my ID and cash in here if I'm not taking this big old purse. And the last thing in here is I threw in the tags for this bag. So it was $34.99 at Target. It's the A New Day brand. And here's the information if you want to try to look for it at your Target. If I can find a link, I will link it down below. But the other thing I love about this bag is it just has a lot of pockets. I'm a big fan of pockets. And there's this almost hidden side pocket here. So of course I'm using that for more lip products. These are my real, like, really want to be able to grab and go. So I have a little thing of Listerine breath mints. And my Fenty lip gloss, which is just my all-time favorite forever. It's so pretty. It's just the prettiest, sparkliest, most flattering warm color. I have my favorite lip balm, the Agave Bite Lip Balm. If I ever have chapped lips, this is like life-saving. And then I have the lipstick I'm wearing right now, which is just Revlon number 740, certainly red. As you can see, it is certainly red. Sometimes you just need a red lip to like power through the day. So that is everything on the outside of my bag. I'll show you inside. I'm always organizing my purses in like pouches and smaller containers. So you can see, nothing is really loose in my purses. So I'll take this big pouch out first. I love to use these in all of my bags. They're from Glossier. If you order skincare from them, it comes in these free pouches. Just fun, bright pink, bubble wrap looking pouches. And I have like a pink, well, everything in my life is pink themed, but my purse is especially pink themed right now. So here's my hand lotion that I just, I just can't live without it. It's a re I use a refillable little tube. In fact, I need to refill it. And I just refill it out of this big Mamba Jamba because this is my favorite hand lotion of all time. <laughs> so I stock up. It's a Deborah Lipman Rich Girl. And I just refill this. It's cheaper than buying the small size and it keeps it constantly with me when I'm on the go, which is an essential. 
One thing I love about it is it has SPF, so it's nice. Then I have a little mini Glossier pouch. This has their mirror in it. It's just a cute pink mirror and it has their logo and it says you look good. And I think this is just adorable. Matches my color scheme. Then this little bundle is my iPhone charger, portable charger with an iPhone cord and an Apple Watch cord. So <laughs> none of my devices are ever dying when I'm out and about. Then I have a lot of pink macarons in this purse. This one is a lip balm that actually one of you sent me that I thought was so sweet. It smells good, it's just a nice scented little lip moisturizer and it's in this cutest macaroon container. So I have that, one macaron. Then I just got this, another macaron. This is a hairbrush. Sorry, there's any hair. But it's so cute for a purse hairbrush. There's a mirror in this side. Hmm, I guess I don't really need the other mirror now that I think about it. But it's a nice size to like really be able to brush your hair on the go. And then a good size mirror too. So I love this little set and it kind of keeps it more <laughs> contained in my purse. Then another thing that's a little different if you've seen my other ones in my bag videos, I usually keep it's kind of embarrassing, like little Ziploc bags of different kinds of medication because I'm like the group mom when I go out with friends and I always have everything. Well, I stepped up my travel first aid kit game and I got this on Amazon. Again, it's just really cute. It's a pink case. Inside it has these little squares. And what's really cool about it is you can take, like by default it has six squares inside, but you can take the divider out. So like I took this divider out so it fits a little roll of Tums right here. I have some ginger pills, which are for motion sickness, like if I'm in traffic. I have Advil, I have wellness formula. I brought the jar to show you. This stuff is amazing. If you think you're getting a cold, pop some of this. It's an herbal supplement and it will knock any cold out of you, <laughs> knock on wood. And then I also have some cough drops because I always feel so bad if somebody has a coughing fit or something. And then underneath this little, so this comes out so underneath I also have some band-aids. So I just feel so prepared when I have this little guy in my purse. And it's cute. And if anybody has any problems, I can just hand them this and be like, I hope you feel better. <laughs> I have a tampon, similar sort of reasoning. I've got a Tide pen. This works so well on stains on the go. I always have eye drops in this dry climate. It is Optifree Replenish Drops for Contact Lenses. And the last thing is a setting mist with SPF in it. Really like this one. It's by Supergoop. You can pick it up at Sephora. It mists on really easily. It goes on really well over makeup. And I try to reapply my sunscreen throughout the day. And I think I just got that in my hair. All right, so that pouch is like the biggest thing in here, but it's kind of my prepared for anything pouch. Then I've got another macaron. This is kind of unnecessarily big to be in my purse, but it's so cute. My aunt got me this and I wasn't sure what to keep in it. So I started keeping gum in it because I buy the big pack of gum. Again, same logic as the lotion and I like decant it into other containers. So when somebody asks, hey, Charlotte, do you have any gum? I'm like, sure. And I whip out this giant like burger sized macaron. I think it's so cute. And then I've got my sunglasses. All right, now I'm just carrying my Ray-Bans. They're just really simple, like way Wayfarer style. Super easy, like if I'm in the convertible, I feel like I have a lot more sun protection with these. So those are easy to put on my face. Especially if I don't have any makeup on, I feel like more hidden. Not that you have to hide if you don't have makeup on. Then this is my wallet. So this is the Louis Vuitton medium sized agenda. I use it as a wallet, it's my baby. I always decorate the inside, something different each month. And I also, I have all my cards in here, then I also like to budget with cash. I have videos on this whole thing if you're curious. But I, um, I think like a lot of people struggle to stick to a budget, so I just use cash. It's like the simplest way. I keep it in these little envelopes in here. Love this system. I've been using this system for so long. I have coupons in the back, receipts. Then inside here, there's that kind of like standard issue back purse pocket. It has a zipper. 
and I just started using it for change. Just loose change and nothing else. Because when you're on a cash budget, obviously you get a lot of change in your life. So for instance, if I purchased something out of my pet's budget and it was like $19, or I don't know, let's say $18, so they gave me a dollar and some change back, I would put the dollar back in the budget category and I would put the change just loose in here because like I'm not gonna try and budget my quarters and my pennies, like that's a little bit extreme. So I just keep the bills in my budget and I throw the change in there so I don't have to deal with like a coin purse or anything. My hair keeps getting like, my hair keeps attaching to things. So that way I don't have to track a coin purse, it makes it a lot easier. Then this side has even more built-in pockets. This purse is like a pocket-loving dream. And I have tissues in one and I have my keys in the other, so it's the Louis Vuitton key container. So pretty, pink inside. I love it, it's the best way to carry keys, keep them organized. And that is it. I'm feeling kind of proud of myself because this is a big purse. And my instinct is to fill things up, but I don't know, am I just crazy? It seems like a reasonable amount to be carrying. It's like, it's doable. If I'm going on errands, that's what I usually schlep around with me. So as always, I keep you very thoroughly updated on what's in my bag because for some reason we all just love that so much. And thank you for watching. If you're new here, if you haven't had a chance yet, hit subscribe. That way you won't miss any of the goodness to come. We do a lot of beauty, organization, planners, lifestyle vlogs, Disney, travel, all sorts of stuff on this channel. And I love getting to know you guys, so I will say hi in the comments and I will see you around in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.